In this video, I want to introduce to you periodic functions. Now, periodic functions you will have seen and met before. Here is an example of one y is equal to sine x. So periodic functions repeat themselves indefinitely in either direction, either in the positive x direction and, or rather, and the, pos the negative x direction. So y is equal to sine x keeps on going, in other words. And really what we want to be able to do at this point is to be able to identify the period of the function. So the period is over the, is the distance, rather, that the curve repeats itself. So which, which portion of the curve is repeating itself over and over and over again? And you can see it as between 0 and 2 pi. Okay? That would be what we would consider to be the period. Because that part of the, part of the curve is repeating itself over and over and over again in either direction. So I can say that the period of sine x is 2 pi. Now you'll find that y is equal to sine x, y is equal to cos x, tan x, uh, sec x, cosec x, cot x, all of these are periodic. But we're also going to be looking at different types of periodic curves, ones that we can build up from scratch.